Global Mobile Telecommunications has continued to witness an increasing dynamics in this sector. And Nigeria is not left out of this technological advancement. Well, in the past, we've heard of the 1G, 2G, 3G, 4G, and today we're talking about the 5G networks. And the national policy on the 5G network in Nigeria in 2019, November precisely, gave approval for a trial of the 5G network in the country. And this followed a multi-stakeholders consultation and deliberation on the suitability of this technology. Now, in 2021, in September, the Federal Executive Council also gave approval for the deployment of this 5G network. Now, this is to be able to ensure that the 5G network is provided with security in the ecosystem and to also ensure the international best practices and standards are followed. Now, government or stakeholders at one time or the other have also come out to say that this 5G network is the latest technology that the country stands to benefit in terms of telecommunication and mobile services. The deployment of this technology, which is being midwived by the NCC and the Ministry of Communications and Digital Economy, is one thing that has been on for quite a while now. 5G, I think, is much more better than the 4G we were using because actually during the time we were using the 4G, it was not as fast as it is now. It's going to make connectivity broader and um, faster and um, the internet inclusion will be wider. So it's going to be to our advantage. I don't think there is any myth behind it. Yes, rather it's a network infrastructure that is technologically advanced Expertise explanations have it that the 5G network have a lot of advantages including uh, supporting education, economy and other sectors of human endeavor. There are some phones that has 5G in it but my friend told me that I can go to MTN office and my SIM, they can upgrade it to a 5G. Now, with the processes of getting the 5G network are properly deployed to major cities in the country, government has set the target of 2025 to be able to have reached reasonable number of citizens and also parts of the country with this policy. In Abuja, Abdullah Hajia, NTA News.